So in this recording, we're going to share a OneDrive folder with a non-university user. To do that, I'm going to go ahead and open up my file explorer. Here, I will go to OneDrive and I will just select the evaluations folder. As you will notice, it is not currently being shared. So I will right click on it and choose share. Here it says the people you specify can view. I can always change that option, but I'll just leave it at specific people. And I will type in the email address as my Gmail, and I will leave it as a view only. And it gives me a warning that this user is outside of our organization. I will click on Outlook just to verify this information, and I will notice that it will send the link to evaluations, and I'll just hit send. Now I will go to my Outlook where I have my Gmail account linked and I will find the email that was just shared with me. And I can click on that link and it'll ask me to sign in to my Gmail account. So I will hit next. And it wants to send a code for verification. So I will say send code. I can check back in my email or on my phone for the code. And I will enter this code in for verification and sign in. As you notice, it gives me access to this evaluations folder. If I go back a, a level, I will only see the folder that I have access to. So now I can either keep this email message to get back to this location, or I can create a shortcut to easily get back to this location. To create a shortcut on the Windows machine, I will go back to this location. I can simply copy the address by using Control C. And here I can right click on the desktop and select New Shortcut. At the location, I will just paste the address in by hitting Control V, choosing Next, and type the name of the shortcut. In this instance, I will type Shared evaluation and select finish. Now to get to the folder, I can simply select a shortcut. 